So guys, let's compare the, these three phones. Well, the specs are on the screen and you can have a look at them. But I will not go in detail about the specs because you guys already know about them. So firstly, let's talk about the raw performance. Here the Cool One Dual is the clear winner with better processor and higher RAM. Next comes the Lear 2 and the Redmi Note 3 is followed. Though performance is pretty similar in the last two phones, the Lear 2 has a better RAM management so it is ranked higher. Now guys, let's move on to the battery life. Here the Lear 2 is nowhere in the picture as the fight is between the Redmi Note 3 and the Cool One Dual. Now the Cool One Dual wins by the slightest of margins due to the slightly better processor as the Snapdragon 652 has better battery efficiency compared to the Snapdragon 650. But both of these phones will last around 1.5 days on heavy to moderate usage. Now guys, let's move on to the camera on these three phones. Here the picture is completely clear because the Cool One Dual wins with dual cameras at the back. Though all these cameras take good pics in natural light, the noise levels are low in the Cool One Dual in low and artificial lighting situations. Also, it has a better bouquet effect and features like focusing after the shoot is taken. The Lear 2 and the Redmi Note 3 have pretty similar cameras at the back. Now guys, let's talk about the user interference or UI on these three phones. Now the Cool One Dual and the Lear 2 run on Lyco's EUI 5.8 on running on Android Marshmallow and the Redmi Note 3 has got the Marshmallow update recently and runs on MIUI 8. So guys, if you prefer MIUI and you love to flash custom ROMs on your device in the Red, then the Redmi Note 3 is the one to go for because it has far better support for those ROMs compared to the other phones. Now guys, let's talk about some of the cons rapidly. Now, there is no headphone jack on the Lear 2. Well, this is a big disappointment for some users because if you guys have a great pair of expensive headphones at your home, then don't get the Lear 2 as the sound output through the converter is not so good. Now, let's talk about the genetics of all these phones. All these phones have support for FM radio and the Lear 2 and the Cool One Dual also have support for fast charging and the USB Type-C port. So guys, to sum it up, the Cool One Dual is a clear winner if you want to have a better camera, battery and performance at a, sl at a slightly higher price of $39,999. But guys, note that it does not have expandable memory like the Lear 2. Then comes the Redmi Note 3 and lastly the Lear 2 comes at the third position because the Lear 2 lacks as well as expandable memory. So guys, this was my take on these three phones. Hope you liked the video and put a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel for more such content.